what is the best pen to use on one of these? That's today's topic on the Power Sports Memorabilia Show. All right, thank you again for joining me. I'm your host, Matt Powers of the Powers Sports Memorabilia Show. And I thought I would do something a little bit different today than some of the normal topics that we talk about. I thought I would get a official Rawlings MLB batting helmet and to figure out which pen is going to be the best pen on there. So I've got uh, about eight or nine pens here that I'm going to try and show you. So maybe you can kind of see what it looks like before you get your next autograph. Uh, these won't be all the pens that, of course, that are possible and all the pens that you could possibly use. Uh, for example, I don't have uh, Prisma right now, but what I will do is I will be adding more uh, pens, types, and pen colors to this helmet. So hopefully we can see towards the end, hey, you know, we've got 30 different pens on here, and then we can take a picture, a quick video, and that way you can see what all of them look like eventually, okay? So we'll be adding more as we go along with this, okay? So obviously there's a bunch of different pen choices that you can choose. You know, some of the more popular ones are like Sharpie, Prisma, Deco. Those are kind of the, the main three ones that you're probably going to see. So I've got uh, three of those here. I've got one Prisma and a couple different Deco colors and then a couple different Sharpie colors, okay? So let's just get started and see which one is going to be the best, okay? Uh, your first pen here is going to be it's a uh, Deco Fine, and this one is the silver, the 200S one, okay? So, all these pens, I prepped them up a little before. Some of them are older than others, so none of them are all brand new, so that's something to consider as well. But let's just do a Deco Fine here and see what it looks like. All right, there you go. Deco Fine. Pretty good. I kind of expected this one to be kind of one of the best ones there. Decos are really easy to use. They don't splatter a bunch, and uh, I've always had pretty good success with them. Uh, next one we're going to have here, this is a white paint pen here. So same deco here. Uh, the fine, extra fines are a little too, uh, too thin to use, so I wouldn't use that. But let's see if this white one here has got any juice left to it. It's uh, been kind of dying here a little bit, but we'll go ahead and we'll use it uh, on this one, all right? All right, there you go. Deco Fine White, a little, little brighter than the silver one, actually turned out pretty good. So there you go for that one. All righty, let's jump on over to We've got a gold here, so same exact one, fine. This will be a gold. All right. And there you go. Again, pretty solid, looks pretty good to me. Um, it doesn't, it goes pretty good with the pirate helmet. So far, I would probably say that I like the Deco Fine Silver, but the gold would work out pretty good as well. All right, let's jump on over here too. I've got uh, a yellow one. So this one might actually work well for the Pirates ones too. I've actually had this one done on this helmet before and uh, it looks pretty good. I'm not too bad with it. So let's go here. Deco fine yellow. All right, and there's that guy for you. You can see that one kind of pops up a little bit there. That's actually a pretty good color. Uh, not too bad. All right, let's jump around here. That's all I've got for the decos. Let's jump over here to another real popular one, uh, Prisma. This is a broad silver, okay? So it's gonna be a lot thicker. And this tends to be kind of a popular color in size. So let's just go over here. Um, deco broad, all right. There's Deco Broad, you can see that right there. Pretty good one here. And I'll <clears throat> I'll do a video too at the end here and showing you all these ones and maybe take a couple pictures too so you guys can kind of get a still shot and kind of see which one you guys like, might like best. All right, now on to the Sharpies. Sharpies are nah, not very exciting, but some people use them and they need to see kind of what they look like. So we'll just start off here with just a standard Sharpie Gold. Now, yes, you can do paint pens on them. I've got 
one paint pen here, but this is just kind of your standard gold. But let's see what it looks like, all right? Uh, let's jump on over to this side here. Sharpie gold. And that's that right there, see? Kind of bland and boring, doesn't look very good. All right, let's work on over to Sharpie paint pen here. This one is a fine one. And there you go, Sharpie fine, nothing too exciting. But if you're in a pinch and it's the only pen you can get, that's a good one to use, obviously. And here's standard silver Sharpie here. And let's see how this one works, okay? Silver, Sharpie, again, not super cool. So that's it for those pens right now. Uh, again, it will be adding more as we go along here, but uh, check out the Instagram, at Powers Autographs. Uh, I will be posting some images, and so hopefully you can kind of take a look at them and still and kind of figure out which pen would work best for you. You guys got any pens you want me to try on the helmet? Comment below and I will let you know. Again, please subscribe to the channel and also check out the website powersportsmemorabilia.com.